oh man, was this hoop session lit. I'm telling you, you don't want to miss a beat. <laughs> To the cook zone. From my experience, I know, man, when I was six years old, I lost my older brother. My brother was 10 when he died. Died in his sleep, asthma attack, something like that happened. I couldn't really wrap my mind around it even as a kid. I couldn't even like make sense of it. Still don't know how to make sense of it to this day. And it made me, not saying it made me question a lot of things, but it was kind of one of those surreal moments, like how could this happen? to me you know what I mean like how could this have happened like what did he do to deserve it or anything like that right and filled with my mind with all those questions I think there's a couple there's one thing that I know I've definitely taken from that even though it happened the way it did sad and it hurt I've learned to cherish every day I've been given you know what I'm saying witnessing something witnessing somebody leave at such a young age it's like wow like you really don't know Man. Everything that happens to us, man, if we really do believe in Ultimate Creator, those things happen to us. It's not that he wasn't aware, and it's not that he's not there. Everything that happens to us, he's aware of. He knows more. He more. He knows more of the ins and outs than we do. Like we're limited beings. It's kind of hard for us to wrap our mind around certain things. But he has the bigger picture in mind. Not in terms of this had to happen for this to happen this way. But, but more so, he knows the outcome. Whatever happens to you, I don't really worry about it. You're still going to get to you and get to you. Man. Man. Right. This man gave Buddy absolutely crazy work. Crazy work. It's not that God ever left. He sees it and he's aware of it. It's just more so that this could be a testing period for you to really allow some of these pains to push you to God and, um, and recognize that man carrying all this load, all this heartache and just kind of being here and I've kind of given up on believing in you, giving him one more chance, revealing, asking him to reveal himself to you because you're in that period where you're like, man, I don't even know if you're really real. All this stuff has happened. I think there's nothing that you lose when you go to bed and ask yourself, man, God, reveal yourself to me in my life. Because all the stuff that I've seen doesn't make sense. And it's caused me to really doubt you. So, like, just let me know if you're real.
can get off the rim. I hope you enjoyed this video, these quick clips and conversations. I pray that they are beneficial to you in some way. Listen, if you're new, subscribe, leave a like so it can catch on the algorithm. Comment below some of your thoughts, your answers to the questions and conversations that were going down in this video. And follow your boy on the socials for more of these videos and updates as we're continuing to roll. All right, until then, be easy and be breezy, my friend. Peace.